all in, all you. Good morning. I just realized I was over here on Discord chatting with the members and I forgot my water bottle and towel. So if I have to make a quick pit stop for that, I'm gonna do that during this workout. This is gonna be a tough one today. Full body, although we just have six exercises that we are gonna focus on today. So we'll get right into the warm up and as we begin the warm up, I'll explain how this workout is gonna go. And you know this is always an interesting time when I'm trying to warm up and talk. So let's just see how it goes. We're gonna start, first things first, we're gonna take one arm across. We're just gonna do a nice little swipe here, tapping the toe, get a twist here. So we're getting the hips warm, getting the core, getting the arms warm. So today's workout, like I mentioned, we have six exercises. We're gonna work through these exercises three times, but there's gonna be a slight variation. Two sets are gonna be the same. One set is gonna be a little different. Three more here, two and one. From here, hands behind head, we're gonna go down into a squat. Just doing a nice prisoner squat here, down and up. So the first set, we're gonna work heavy. 60 seconds on, 30 seconds to rest for those six exercises. In the middle, then we're going to do those same six exercises, 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off, but we're gonna mix it up and those are gonna be pulses. Finally, we're gonna go back to the 60 seconds on, 30 seconds going heavy, same six exercises. We're gonna finish out 45 on, 15 off, four exercises for abs. So down here, here's three. That's what we got going on today. Two and one. Now we're gonna do a nice little kick, reaching that opposite hand to your toe. So we'll step it back and reach. Good. Feeling this through the hamstrings. But we'll be working about 30 minutes today. Two more and then we'll switch sides. Here's two and one. Walking it over to the other side. Now opposite hand to opposite toe. Don't forget to breathe here as you warm up. Three more from here. Here's three. Two. And we're gonna go into good mornings. Last one, so hands on your hips. Feet just about shoulder width or a little wider here. We're gonna drive the hips back, keep a slight bend in the knee, keeping that back flat and up. So take your time through this, really feel that stretching through the hamstrings, warming up the glutes, and then up. I don't know, did anyone say it in the chat yet? Start your watch, if you'd like to do that. I'm working with traditional strength training today just because we are gonna be going heavy for most of it. So when you are picking your weight, I know we're working for 60 seconds, but still try to maintain a heavier weight. So pick something that's on the top of your range for the exercises we're gonna work through. Two more, here's two. And one, good. Now we're just gonna do a tuck here with the knees, bring them into your chest, and then switch it up. Good. When we do the pulses though, the 30 seconds, then we're gonna drop the weight, because that's gonna be tough. So I'm gonna drop that probably down to just a very minimal weight for that. Three more here, really get that hug in. Two. And one. Last stretch here, because we're gonna start out with some bicep curls, we're gonna get the shoulders involved first. So reach up nice and tall, and then just squeeze down here and then reach up, a activate those bicep muscles almost as you're trying to just, you know, show off your biceps here. So really squeeze and pull down and up. <sighs> Three more. And then we'll get into that first exercise. Here's two, last one. So first exercise on the list today, bicep curl. So again, we're working 60 seconds, but you're gonna get 30 seconds of rest and you're gonna get a lot of time in between bicep curls again. So go heavy here, grab your dumbbells. I'm gonna go with 20 pounds today. That is the top of my range for bicep curls. And then you know, if you always need to um, go down and wait, you can. So 60 seconds on the clock, shoulders roll down and back, going in three, two, and the timer's on. So here we go. 
Take your time with your curls. Make sure you're going all the way down, all the way up. Starting on Monday, we have our new program, Sweet Summer Sweat. Sweet Summer Set Sweat is an eight week cycle and strength combo program. This program is all about short, effective, intentional training so that you can be the strongest you can be this summer but not spend all the time doing it. Over halfway. Now you will see if you have not yet created an account at KayleeCohen.com, highly encourage you to do that so you'll be ready to get that calendar when it comes out. There'll be a link in the descri description though, so in between cycle and strength, you can just pop on over, create your account if you have not. Almost there, here's three, two, and one. 30 seconds to rest. We're gonna switch it up now. So we're alternating between upper and lower body today with our exercises. We're going into a sumo squat next. So you can take two dumbbells, on each leg or one right in the center, whatever you're feeling today. I'm actually feeling like two today. I'm bumping it up to 30 for the sumo squat. Again, go heavy, Ooh, 10 seconds out, so we'll get ready. Again, shoulders rolled down and back, toes turned out, legs wide. We got two, we got one, we've gotta go, here we go. Down, take your time. Through all these exercises today, I really want you to think about just taking it slow. When you're working super heavy, you have to go slow anyways, just to keep your balance, keep your focus, and work through that full range with the heavier weight. Also, with Sweet Summer Sweat, just like our other programs in the past, we have an additional bundle that you can buy for $15. This bundle, I'm telling you, is packed with so much. So a lot of you were asking for, um, recipes, more nutrition side of things. So I have packed it full with that this time. There are 10 recipes to try. Some of these are keto friendly, gluten free, vegan. We've got those in there. There's also um, food hacks. So 10 things that kind of make eating healthier a little bit easier. Then we've got our printable calendar, which will show you the workouts and the durations of the workouts. So you know what's coming. Here's two, 30 seconds to rest. And then finally, we have a take five journal, which I love this part of it. This is gonna help you um, just kind of build and strengthen your mindset muscle, which you know is so important here in our training. That's what helps us get stronger in life too. So that is in the bundle, highly recommend it. It will help you take this program to the next level. We're doing shoulder press next. So just a regular shoulder press. I'm going with 20 this time, Whew, almost there. And let's begin, here we go. Press it up, wrist straight. Think about punching the ceilings. Oh, Michelle, yes. Okay, I want to see your makeup now. I love bright eyeshadow. That is so awesome. <laughs> Take your time here. Come on, 30 seconds, halfway. You can also take a wider stance in this exercise if you'd like to do that. Just make sure those hips are tucked under. Make sure you're not rounding the back. Ooh. Almost there, then we're gonna switch it back up to lower body. Five, three, Two and one. All right, next exercise, bringing it to the mat. Actually, for the next two exercises, we're gonna do glute bridge followed by chest press. But right now, let's just focus on glute bridge. So grab your heavy dumbbells for that. Ooh, I'm gonna use 25 for this one. Rolling it onto our back. Dumbbell, if you have one dumbbell, it's gonna go right across your hip. If you have two, right up on each hip. Five seconds out. Going in three. Two and one, here we go. Squeeze. Now you do want to think about driving your hips up towards the ceiling here, but you don't want to round or arch your back as you do that. So you still want to stop it at that point where you think about having a straight line from your knees down to that point on the ground where your shoulder blades are. But you can still squeeze those glutes right here at the top while keeping that flat back, good. 
Halfway through, keep going. Whew. We're getting close to finishing this first circuit of our longer set, full range. Next is going to be those pulses. So we've hit all the muscle groups. So they're already feeling it. Breathing 10 seconds out. Five, three, two, and one. All right, chest press is next. You know what? I'm gonna try to stick with this weight. This might be, this might be tough, but chest muscles are very strong. So make sure you're going heavy with this one. Oh yeah, this is gonna be tough, but it's gonna be fun. Oh, I'm smiling, yay. All right, 10 seconds. We've got one more exercise for the lower body after this, and then we're gonna start switching gears. Chest press in three, two, and one. Here we go. Now the chest press is actually one of those exercises where you can have a little bit of an arch in your, in your back to give you more leverage here to press. So you'll really get that weight in the shoulder blades. Exhale as you press up. Thirty seconds. Really think about squeezing those chest muscles. You have that egg right there in your underarm and you're squeezing it. Good. Fifteen seconds. Four, three, two, one. Nice. Dumbbells down. Going into a squat for this last uh, exercise in this circuit. So grab heavy weights. We're going to put the dumbbells right up here on your shoulders. So two dumbbells. Okay. Woo, 10 seconds out. Let's get ready. Start with that chest up, shoulders roll down and back. Here's three, two, and one. Let's go, 60 on. And take your time here. exercises in this one right here. You do get one more shot at these after our pulses. Try to maintain this weight if you can for what you've worked through this first circuit. So after this, we're gonna get 30 seconds to rest. Then we're gonna go right into the pulses. They're gonna move quick. So you're gonna wanna get your dumbbells ready because we only have 10 seconds in between those pulse sets. Almost there. Five, three, oh my, two. And one, awesome. So same six exercises we're gonna work through. I'm going to go ahead, I'm gonna get my 10 and 15 pounds. So I'm probably gonna alternate between those two for upper and lower. So get those ready. There, actually. Starting out with bicep curl pulses. So for those, it's just gonna be halfway up and we're gonna be pulsing it out. 30 seconds, let's pulse it, here we go. I bumped my weight up on this one for a second. Let's see how this goes. So little move, couple inches up, couple inches down. Keep those arms nice and close. Keeping that contraction in the bicep. Wrists are straight, so don't over curl your wrists with this. So make sure your wrists aren't tucking up. They're nice and straight, so your dumbbells just resting in your hands. 10 seconds to rest here. Here's three, two, and one. Quickly, if you need to switch weight for sumo squat pulses, do that, but let's get into position. This is gonna go by quick. We're just gonna hold it low and pulse it. So bring it down and let's pulse. Here we go, pulse it out. Keeping that chest up, keeping good form. Ooh. 20 seconds. 
Can you feel the inner thighs right now? I don't know about you, but my inner thighs are screaming a bit. 10 seconds. Five. Here's three, two, and one. Nice. Shoulder press pulses next. This is where I'm trying to, uh, maybe I can keep it. Mm. Maybe I didn't need those 10 pounds. Hey, you're stronger than you think sometimes. All right, 30 seconds, pulse it out. Here we go. Good little move. Don't forget to breathe. Keep those hips tucked under, so make sure your bum isn't sticking back. Tuck them under. Almost there. Five, three, two, one. Nice. Glute bridge pulses next. So bring it right onto the ground. Roll it back, dumbbells up, get those hips up, and let's pulse it. Here we go, squeeze, 30 seconds. Weight stays in the heels. So drop it down just a couple inches and then right back up. This is a nice fluid motion. We're not holding it anywhere for any length of time. Just working straight through the pulses. 10 out, come on, keep pulsing, you've got this. Goodness. Whew. Three, two, one. Switching it up for chest press now. So we're gonna grab those dumbbells. This one, you're gonna get those uh, arms up off of the mat about, uh, say, 10 inches or so and pulse it. Here we go, 30 seconds. So again, wrists are straight, punching towards the ceiling. Keep that contraction in the chest. So think about squeezing those muscles. Again, this is a nice fluid motion. We're not holding it at the bottom or the top. Working right through, 10. Come on, eight. Five, three, <laughs> shake, two, one. Oh my goodness, all right, squats, bring it up. Last time for pulses, then we're gonna switch it back to that full range, going heavy for 60 seconds. Here's three, dumbbells up, two, and one. Keep it low, pulse it, 30 seconds. Weight stays in the heels, keep that chest up. Ooh. <laughs> oh my goodness. 10 seconds. Almost there, five, three, two, and one. Nice job. All right, 30 seconds to rest here. 30 seconds, then we're gonna switch it up back to full range. Wow, breathing. All right, so remember, I challenged you to try to keep that dumbbell weight that you picked from the very beginning for this one too. So grab your weight, 10 seconds out. Ooh, okay, eight seconds, bicep curls, five, here's three, two, and let's curl. One thing I didn't mention about the sweet summer sweet summer set. This is gonna be a this is gonna be a tongue tire for me. I'm gonna tell you that right now. <laughs> I did not think about that when I was like, I just love this name. Sweet summer sweat bundle is free if you are a member on Buy Me a Coffee. So if you're not a member and you're like, hey, that might sound good, because you'll get some extra benefits with that as well. So if you're a member, don't worry, that bundle's gonna be coming out to you for free this weekend. I'll probably get that out to you on Sunday with the new, with the early access to Monday's ride. Which is tomorrow, isn't it? <laughs> well, it's like Sunday, that feels so far away, but it's not. Almost there. Come on, keep curling. Here's three, two, one. Sumo squat, grab your dumbbells. Okay, shoulders rolled down and back, 20 seconds. Let's start walking those legs out, getting ready. 15 out. 10 seconds. 
Okay, five seconds. Sumo squat in three, two, and one. Here we go. Down and squeeze. Next week's workouts, because they are the first workouts here for Sweet Summer Sweat. I just want you to know I'm not going easy on you for these eight weeks, okay? We're gonna push it because I really want you to see what you are capable of in just 20 to 30 minutes a day. Like you are, it's, I'm telling you, if you give it everything, you're gonna get that back out of it. So that's why I do not believe you need to train for an hour, hour and a half every day to get the results you want if you are focused and you're training with intention. So that's what we're doing. And plus, we, we want to enjoy our life. We don't want to just sit around training all day. At least I don't, I don't. I mean, I'd love it, but listen, I got things to do, and I know you do too. <sighs> Almost there. Five, three, two, one. Okay, shoulder press, grab your dumbbells. All right, I know this is gonna be a tough exercise for me to try to keep this weight, but we got it. <sighs> 20 seconds out. Breathing. Whew. Okay, 15 out. Last time through the 60 seconds of work here, then we're gonna switch it up to abs. So we are well over halfway through this workout and you're rocking it. Three seconds, here's two, and press. Here we go. Make sure that dumbbell bar is back towards the heel of your hand, closer towards your wrist. That's gonna make sure that you are not letting your wrist fall back as you press up. So make sure it's nice and strong here. Punching towards the ceiling. Fingers are just here to help control that weight. They are not holding the weight. Controlling, not holding. 30. Keep it strong. Oh my god. Fifteen. Ten out. Oh my goodness. Five. Three. Two. One. Oh, back to glute bridge. Glute bridge and chest press. So grab your weights for that. Meet me on the mat. Rolling it back. Three exercises left here. 10 seconds. I'm losing my way. Breathing. Here's three, two, and let's go, glute bridge. Come on up nice and strong and down. Now the exhale comes here with the work as we squeeze at the top. So right here you exhale and then down. Good. 30 seconds. Good, take your time. Ten seconds out. Here's three, two, and one. Thirty seconds. We switch it up to chest press. So adjust your dumbbells if you need to. We're gonna go soon. Oh my! You can get the legs a little tuck here if you want to stretch out there just a bit before we go. Oh my goodness. Ten seconds. All right, grab your weight. Five out. Here's three, two, chest press. Again, really think about driving those shoulder blades into the mat as you press up. And one thing I want to remind you of, I know if you've been training with me for a while, you probably remember me talking about this, but if you are new to training with me, 
We go heavy so that we can build definition in our muscles. Lifting heavy is not going to bulk you up and make you look big. Going heavy is going to give you those, you know, the definition, the curves, I guess, shall we say where if you're training with lighter weight, that doesn't activate those muscles that build the definition. That's more endurance, and those muscles tend to be a little bit smaller, so you would have a more, I guess I'll say flat look, which is not a bad thing. It all depends on what you're working with, but so here's three, two, and one. Nice, okay. We're bringing it up for squat. So grab your, dumb, your dumbbell weight for squat. But again, just a reminder, so if you are looking to build that definition, do not be shy to go heavy, because that's exactly what will, it will help you do. <sighs> Breathing. All right, 10 seconds. Last 60 seconds of work before we start to transition down to the mat for abs. So five seconds, here's three, here's two, and let's go. Oh. Keep that head, chest up. Almost halfway there. Exhale as you press up. That's where that work is coming into play. We're working the quads, the hands, the glutes. 15 seconds. That's a couple more reps, so keep it strong. Six, four, three, two, and one. All right, 30 seconds. Now, meet me on the mat. We don't need any dumbbells, so we can get those all out of the way. Oh, not one of the best days to forget my towel. I'll just say that. All right, so we are gonna do, we're gonna keep one leg up, and that opposite arm is going to reach towards that opposite leg that is, just keep this leg stable here. We're crossing over modification. You keep those feet down, cross body crunch. Going in three, two, and one. Here we go. We're really working the entire abdominal complex right now. We're gonna be working the obliques rectus abdominis and the transverse through these four exercises. Ooh. So 15 seconds of rest is all we get in between abs. So this next exercise, all we're gonna do is simply switch it to the other side. Ooh. Five, three, two, and one. So other leg out or you're modifying with those feet on the ground. Opposite hand or opposite elbow to that opposite leg. Five seconds and we go. Keep that leg stationary here. Two and one, crunch it up. Really get those shoulder blades up. You're getting all the sound effects from me today. Oh my goodness. And yes, we have a cycling class that follows. Good old times today. <laughs> oh, I will say one thing about Sweet Summer Sweat. We, the only workouts, well, they're optional. Saturday workouts are always optional because I know they're longer, but those are gonna be the only workouts that we do keep longer in this program. And it's only because it's just the most amazing community time. So we just love our time together on Saturdays. Two and one, nice. Okay, next exercise is going to be a staggered reverse crunch. So for that, one leg is gonna be a little bit higher than the other, and you're gonna keep them long. Now modify, you can bend the legs. Here's two and a one, so let's crunch. Hands right next to your body. Really get those hips up. I am telling you, this is a burner like no other. Whew. 
This is more of an advanced move with the legs straight, so if you do need to bend them at all, make sure to do that. And we've got one more exercise after this, and it's just gonna be switching those legs around. 10 seconds. Oh, are you screaming with me right now? My God, here's four, three, two, and one. Oh, goodness, 15 seconds. Just switching it to the other side. Okay, four seconds. So other leg comes up higher. Here's one, let's crunch. Reverse crunch, that is. Thirty seconds. Come on, keep it strong. Twenty seconds out. So don't forget, if you have not signed up on my website yet, it's just KayleeCohen.com. Sign up, create your account, and Sweet Summer Sweat will be there tomorrow, so you can check everything out, get the bundle and be ready to go on Monday. Last one. Whew. If you've already created an account, keep an eye on there. If you're a member, watch your email for the bundle or grab the bundle if you're not a member. I will see you over for the cycling channel. If you are done, don't forget to stretch today. Cannot wait for Monday. I am telling you what, it's gonna be such an amazing eight weeks together. We're gonna make the most of this summer. I love you so much. I will see you for the cycling workout or the stretch. And I already said I love you, so I'll just kiss now.